Hi everybody, it's James here at From The Anvil. I hope everybody's doing really well. A very, very late aftermath video because I was tired last night and life has been getting in the way. So here I am just doing my post-game thoughts on the win against Silkeborg. It finished West Ham United 1, Silkeborg 0 at the London Stadium. West Ham finally finalises its top spot in its Conference League group and will bypass the round of 32 as a result. Major advantage in this competition, of course. And once all the group stage is done, I want to see who drops down from the Europa League and look at people we could be potentially facing against. Well, teams we could be... You know, we'll be facing people, but we'll be facing teams as well because there are teams are made up of people. But yeah, 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 you get what I'm saying. Um, overall, thoughts on the game? Uh, boring, but we got it done. Um, I thought Aguered was absolutely fantastic in defence for his debut. He had 100% passing as well. And he's a very energetic defender who wants to make things happen from the back. We've also got um, Connor Coventry who's getting a shout out in this game as well. Because I thought he had a really good performance. He looked very comfortable on the ball. He even had a shot off target. And as opportunistic as it was, just a shame we didn't go in. I thought that um, we just got the job done. I know it was a penalty which Lanzini scored, but still, a 1-0 win is all we needed to get through this group. Aguerd, just a fantastic performance from him. He has to start against Man United, and he has to be our starting centre-back from now on. I told you all how my defence needs to look. It needs to be Kura, Zuma, Aguerd, Cresswell from now on. And we've got a very good back line. Aguerd and Zuma will work well off of each other. Um, who else played well in this game? I um, think that Antonio, on one side, no, struggled a little bit in this. He, he just needs a little bit more confidence, or maybe he's just lacking in other areas. I do not know what's going on with him. But um, we got that win. I think that uh, Aguerd played excellently in that game. Great debut. And I can't wait to see more of him. We're playing Manchester United now on Sat on Sunday, rather. And it's a few games left now before the World Cup. And that's coming up thick and fast. And I'll be doing things on my channel I'm going to talk to you about in the near future to cover that. Thank you very much for watching this very quick aftermath. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to sub for more content. Take care, everyone, and I'll see you all soon.